guys, it's Kelly, and today we're filming a new video. Hey guys, it's Kelly, it's Kelly, and this is Brenda. Hey guys, it's Kelly, and hey guys, it's Kelly. In today's video, I'm doing a very exciting thing, and I'm going to be reviewing and trying out the Tarte and Whitney Simmons collab. Oh, I haven't really swatched any of the palette. I have put the lipstick on, but other than that, I haven't tried anything else out. So the palette looks like this, and it's so pretty. Like, la absolutely love it. And there's a good size mirror, and it says shape your money maker. That's cute. And then the inside looks like this. There's a highlight called Flex, a blush called Sweat, and then there's six eyeshadows. There's Cut, Snatched, Tone Up, Trainer, Cardio, and Rep. With the kit, you get the Whitney Simmons lipstick, and it's in Bare Bud. But this is a really nice nude color. I tried it out yesterday just because I wanted to see like what it was. It's more of like a chapstick type of consistency. It's really good if you have dry lips like me. And then also you get the Maneater mascara. I've never tried this mascara and I've always wanted to, so when I saw that this kit had this mascara in it, I was like 10 times happier. I'm not the best at makeup, so I want to take how I do my makeup like that serious because I'm not a beauty guru. I am just doing this just because I love Whitney Simmons and I, this is like my first collab palette that I've ever gotten. I'm just going to get started because I really want to try this out. So the first thing I'm going to be doing is trying to find a cleaner brush. This is the cleanest I have. I'm going to take the blush and sweat. I'm just going to try and put this on. I think I actually really like this blush. Hopefully it doesn't look like I'm putting too much on. Yeah, it looks a lot on the camera, but it honestly doesn't look like that much in person, so. Blend it out. This has like a little bit of extra powder on it. I think I actually really, really like this. Next, I'm going to be putting the highlighter flex on. I'm really excited. I have this little eyeshadow brush I use for highlighter. Ooh. I can always see like this side of the highlight. highlighter better and then the other side just because like this cheekbones a lot more. Girl. <laughs> Girl. What? My nose. I love a little highlight on the nose. Okay, I love that. If you can't tell, I'm having a little bit too much fun. I feel like Whitney Simmons where she puts on so much highlighter. I love highlight, so. Here I am. So I'm going to be taking, I'm gonna start with the eyes. I'm just gonna take this little brush, sh shade cut, and I'm gonna use it as a, yeah, like in the crease, yep. What's that called, transition shade? I think that's it. Next, I'm going to be taking the shade Snatched. I'm just gonna put that there. This is me pretending that I know what I'm doing. You can't tell. I have no clue what I'm doing. The eyeshadows are super easy to blend, and I'm not that good at eyeshadow, so that's saying it's a really good eyeshadow because. Next, I'm gonna be taking the shade Tone Up. I'm just gonna pack that on like the inside of the eye. I guess the outer half, not the inside. Oh, I like this. It doesn't look the best because I'm not good at eyeshadow, but it's pretty good for me. I hope nobody came to this video thinking like, oh, I'll get like a good um, makeup tutorial. This is honestly a makeup tutorial for somebody by somebody that can't do makeup. <laughs> Next, I think I'm gonna take trainer and put it on the lid. Let's hope that's not a mistake. This might be too dark. Ooh, it's not a mistake, girl. Girl. Okay, this might not be like everybody's cup of tea for eyeshadow, but for like 
no, like, I mean the way that I'm doing my eyeshadow. Um, the only tutorial I saw was Winnie Simmons, and I don't think I did it at all the way that she did it, but, um, you live and you learn. These eyeshadows are so good. I'd recommend. Okay, we put a little bit extra snatched in the, yep, crease. I'm gonna put tone up on the bottom. Next, I'm gonna put flex. I'm gonna take flex and put it on like the inner corner, just for a pop. I think that's all I'm gonna do for eyeshadow because if I do any more, I feel like it will look crazy. Oh, yes. Yes, we love this. I love it. Next, I'm going to curl my eyelashes and put some like brown eyeliner on. Okay, now I'm gonna put the Man Eater uh, mascara on. I already really like the brush. This isn't a review on this mascara, but I've never used it before, so it kind of is. But it's been out for a while, I think, so. Oh, girl. Looks like I have falsies on. We love that. Hey, Stan. Hey, Stan. Can't get over this highlight. Honestly, I feel like this palette is worth it. If, even if, like, you're not, like, the biggest fan of the eyeshadow colors, just for the highlight and blush. Last but not least, we're gonna put the lip shade on. Okay, I'm gonna put this on. I have never liked nude lipsticks on me, and I feel like this is the only one that has ever like, like I've not hated. I actually really like this shade. I feel like it looks really natural from like afar too. Up close, I've always hated anything on my lips, so like, at least I get to look in the camera and see it and like actually like it. But yeah, I really like this look. I would 1,010% recommend getting this palette, going to Ulta, getting it. Yeah, I would 1,010% recommend getting this palette, trying it out, supporting Whitney. We love her. That's my little tutorial and review of the Whitney Simmons X Tarte Palette. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment down below any other videos that you want to see from me. And uh, yeah, let me know down below also what you think about this palette and if you have it and what you think about it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below, like, subscribe, hit the little bell so you get notifications anytime I post a video. And I'll see you guys later.